Well, we are halfway home in our look back at the Hawkeyes 2010 Orange Bowl team. Thank you, Ann. One of the big stories from that game was Iowa's suffocating run defense. The black and gold dominated Georgia Tech's triple option attack. And most of the credit was sent towards the Hawkeyes' wily defensive coordinator. Adam Rosso takes a look at the wizardry of Norm Parker on that January night in Miami. That game right there, well, that was all him on defense. We just did what he said, and that, that was all him. He drew it up, made it easy for us. It was an old-school game plan devised by an old-school coach. He had started coaching at a time when the triple option was everywhere. Four decades of defensive experience coming in handy at the Orange Bowl. When Norm found out that we were playing Georgia Tech, and he found out that we had probably a month, maybe more, to prepare for him, I think there was no doubt in his mind that we weren't going to shut him down. He grew up in the triple option era, so he knew how to handle it. He knew how to scheme it. He knew where guys were going to line up. He knew how to, you know, how to, how to coach the reads and everything. Norm Parker was already a legend by the time the Hawks played in Miami. You gotta, get to, hey, you gotta bang that guy before you leave! But his scheme to stop Georgia Tech's offense was one of his finest concoctions. He just simplified it. He made it very easy. Where He goes, basically, we just line up like they, they do. We line up like they do. We move like they do. Uh, we beat them up front. We try to force the ball outside. Uh, they're not going to beat us up the middle. He was calm, cool, and collected in every meeting. This is what we're going to do. If you do your job, we'll be successful. Believing in the plan was easy because of how much the defenders believed in Parker. You know, he's an old guy, had a bunch of knowledge, just super smart. Always with it, always on point. One, two, three. We're going to fight, 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 fight for Iowa. He could relate to anybody from anywhere. In any situation, he had an answer for. Um, he was somebody he wanted to make proud, somebody he knew you could trust. Norm's tutelage and just Norm's coaching ability. We all bought into it. Um, so whatever he said, we certainly did. Iowa held Tech to just 155 yards of offense and under three and a half yards per carry in the win. One of Parker's final masterpieces before he died in 2014 at the age of 72. Seeing his face after the game was, that was the highlight of my career. You know, seeing how happy he was and the joy and everything. Norm is a legend, man. He's somebody I miss every day. Reporting in Rock Island, I'm Adam Rosso. Boy, powerful story there, Adam. Powerful words from Pat Anger. And once again, uh, the encore edition of the 2010 Orange Bowl rebroadcast this Saturday night, 7 o'clock, on the Quad City CW, Channel 26.1. And Adam's special reports will continue all week as we get you ready for the Orange Bowl this Saturday night. And very exciting stuff indeed.